All right, good afternoon, evening, I should say now, guys. Um, I wanted to give you a quick tutorial. I tried to find one on a QR code generator and couldn't find one, so I thought I'd do you a quick one. Um, I just used the QR code generator.com site, and this is what it opens up to you. You can see you can log in and sign up. I don't ever do that because I have a way around, a workaround. So um, I, it just comes to this screen. You see it's select a code type. So you've got all these different types that you could use if you want to use a QR code to trigger anything else here. I've actually used a QR code for my email when I'm out doing presentations, and that way it's a quick fix for them that they can zap that. I've used it for a PDF as well. So there's many things that you could do here, but we're going to go ahead and let it, it defaults to the website. We're going to keep it as such. We're going to go to next step. And then you see this box is asking for a QR code. So I'm just going to go up here and grab our popular that I've been working on. Um, well, let me, uh, let me say I'm going to do, uh, uh, let me just grab something over here. You can see where I've been working. Let's see, let's say, um, flags. All right, so let's say that I really like this article. So all I'm going to do is copy the URL at the top, as you can see. Copy that. All right, I'm going to go back to my QR generator here, and I'm going to put that right there. And then I'm going to say next step, and there is my QR code generator. And it sounds like my movie is playing in the background, so let me see if I can get that stopped real quick. It is. So then I'm going to come back over to the QR generator page, and you can see I have my QR code. So if you scan that, it's going to take you to that piece that Obama is speaking about right now, President Obama, I should say. So I'm going to just use the snipping tool, and we've talked about that in class. Um, it, you can type it in, or you can go look for it. Let me show you what it looks like. I'll bring my screen down. It is this right there, and the minute I click on that, it actually gives me um, this box and I can say new and then you will see that this box appears alright so let's go back over here I'm going to uh, to then take my snipping tool and I'm gonna put my crossbar over there and I'm gonna cut that out and that I will save save as, put it somewhere on my computer, and then it's ready to go from there, and I can put that just like an image anywhere else. Hope this helps.